It's Friday once again, which means it must be Zerday. This week you'll find him at the familiar spot on Titan. Just turn left from your fast travel point and you'll find him a little way down inside his dark room. The weapon this week is the Sweet Business Auto Rifle. The main perk is a larger magazine and increased accuracy when firing from the hip. However, the main draw of this weapon are the final two traits, which boost range and rate of fire when holding the trigger, and automatically load picked up ammo into the magazine. Combine that with high caliber rounds and you've got an enemy melting machine that never stops firing as you push through the crowds, pretty neat. The damage itself is kind of average so I wouldn't class it as a top tier exotic, but such a high fire rate and some good synergy with other exotic armors is definitely worth having in your arsenal. For Hunters this week we have the chest piece Raiden Flux. This one is a must own for all you budding arc striders out there as it essentially gives you back one of the arc blade perks from Destiny 1. Wearing this armour will buff damage output and duration through quick attacks, essentially prolonging the mob clearing abilities of the super, whilst making it a viable piece for small bosses. Next up, the Doomfang Pauldrons make a return for Titans. These gauntlets work together with your super by recharging your shield throw with shield bash melee kills, and melee ability kills recharge the super itself. The Sentinel class has some really nice support functions, so refreshing supers regularly is actually pretty handy. Finally, we have some Warlock Gauntlets named Winter's Guile. The perks are pretty straightforward in that eliminating enemies with your melee will buff your melee damage. Now, on paper, these gloves look a little bit pointless, but what it doesn't tell you is that it stacks up to five times. That's five stack damage buffs on your melee punch, not your melee abilities. So partner this with your Devour skill tree and you have a punching invincible machine and it's super fun and can be very powerful. So that's everything for this week, comment, like and subscribe and we'll be back again next Friday. Take care.